A lot of facts about the shooting death of Brenna Taylor remain unknown. But even some facts that have been released through police reports and audio tapes have caused confusion. Taylor, a 26-year-old black woman, was shot and killed in her apartment on March 13 by three white Louisville Metro police officers, Detective Miles Cosgrove, Detective Brett Hankison, and Sergeant Jonathan Mattingly. Taylor's death has fueled protests against racial injustice and police brutality in Louisville. Question, was Brenna Taylor asleep at the time of the shooting? The answer is, no. Taylor's boyfriend, Kenneth Walker, told police in an interview that he and Taylor were awake. She's like, who is it? Loud at the top of her lungs. No response. So I am like, what the heck? He said. Police said they knocked and, after getting no response, used force to enter the apartment, according to a statement from Mattingly. The case is now in the hands of Kentucky Attorney General Daniel Cameron, and the FBI is also conducting an investigation. Question, can Walker be re-charged? The answer is, yes. Charges against Walker were dismissed without prejudice, which means that charges can be filed again. Question, can Louisville's police chief suspend the officers in Taylor's death without pay as the investigation continues? The answer is no. A 2015 document clarifying state law says the chief can suspend officers without pay only in very limited circumstances. Officers can only be suspended without pay before an investigation is complete when evidence eliminates genuine doubt regarding what conduct has occurred. That evidence would include photos or videos, which the department has said it does not have.